Okay. In what universe this amount of fabric is a size large top? This is not a large shein. fabulous today because I am fresh from a new hair well I didn't get my hair cut I got some curtain bangs what do we think and I got some some balayage some blonde put it back in new hair who this welcome back to my channel my name is Jessica of the blog miss more style here on YouTube I make videos about affordable fashion beauty lifestyle and travel make sure to subscribe because I upload two to three times a week I am doing a Shein haul I do Shein hauls about once a month here Shein is very nice to send me my picks each month to share with you all so that is what we were are doing today but it's gonna be a little bit different <sighs> I'm a little nervous about this but it's a swimsuit haul I've never done a swim haul on my channel before. I'm definitely feeling a little bit vulnerable to put these swimsuits on for uh, the camera, but we are gonna go with it because I wanted to do this for science. And the reason I say that is because I have long looked at the swimsuit section at Shein and thought, wow, so many cute swimsuits. They're so affordable. They're so on trend. They're so freaking cute. But mm, I don't think that they're going to fit these. Full disclosure, I am a 34 double D bra size, which makes buying cute, on trend, stylish swimwear a huge headache because swimwear is really, I feel like, not made for people like me who have um, a size six body but have large boobs. It's just, it, it, yeah, it's, they just don't. I mean, yeah. I have to shop at very specific places. I usually have to spend a lot of money to get a good quality supportive top that actually fits everything in it. So needless to say, this is why I've never done really a Shein swim haul. But today I wanted to do it because I know that there's gotta be other people out there who are similar to me, who are thinking to themselves, can I shop for swimwear at Shein? So I've ordered seven bathing suits here. I've got some one pieces and I've got some bikinis and we're gonna try these on and answer the question, is Shein swimwear actually worth it is it wearable we're gonna find out if you would like to shop any of the suits that i'm about to show you i will link them all down below um as well as the sizes that i got in these but let's just go ahead and get started so the first suit that i got i've had in my favorites for quite a while and it is a one piece it is so adorable when i saw this print first of all look at how stinking cute that is it's like very tropical got a couple cheetahs on there you got some fun floral it's just this really cute blush pink background with these bright colors but the thing that really caught my eye about it was the fact that these straps are like a gold chain so curious to see if these cup sizes are going to work out for me they do have a little bit of a push-up situation in them which typically i don't like because i don't need to push them up they're already there they're already in your face there's gonna be a lot of me venting about having big boobs in this video and let me just clue you in on something I don't enjoy having them <laughs> if I could have like smaller ones I would be so happy just because fashion is not made for people I need to stop ranting about my boobs. Anyway, love this suit. I figured that this would be something that I could maybe wear as like a bodysuit in summertime and it would be really cute because I think this one piece might be a winner. Here is the one piece on. I actually really, really like this suit um, and I think it fits pretty well. Again, I got a medium. The problem that I'm having here is the fact that these underwires and this cup is really just technically it's too small for my bra size so like they're not quite fitting in there the way that they should to make them look the best although it's not completely the end of the world i can totally make this work and it feels comfortable i don't feel like you know anything is gonna pop out or anything but i just wish that you know there was a little bit bigger of a cup size happening so that they would fit in there the way they're supposed to be so they can look juicy and good the way they're supposed to look but I think this swimsuit is definitely a keeper. It's a win. I, again, really, really love these gold straps. I think it's such a cute, very different touch on a swimsuit. And they don't feel like they're, like, cutting into me or anything. It's actually the perfect uh, amount of strap for me, personally. And they don't feel like they're going to, like, fall down either. So A plus on the strap length. I really do think I'm going to wear this as a bodysuit as well because it's just so much fun. Next suit. 
let's see what size did I get I got a large in this and a lot of the bikinis I got larges I literally spent so much time reading the reviews that people left trying to decipher what size I should be but there weren't a whole lot of people who had a similar size body to me writing reviews so I was kind of in the dark I had and mostly bought larges so here is this cute little suit I love 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 the color combination of this if my camera will focus I'll just back up I just really love the color combination of this it's very very like neon and bright and the fabric is kind of like this like ribbed fabric got like a slight padding in it they've got these little inserts which you can um, easily take out it does have adjustable straps and then the bottoms I'm just gonna tell you guys right now the bottoms of basically all of these suits are like very very minimal and barely there like tiny that's really kind of the trend right now with swimwear I know a lot of people hate that I'm personally I don't hate it but I definitely don't wear these when I'm like around my family you know what I mean like it's not like a family time appropriate type of swimwear but if I'm just like with friends if I'm at the beach uh, if I'm on vacation sure taking a thirsty Instagram picture absolutely we're gonna see because the bottoms this is also the problem the bottoms are larges as well as the top you can't buy the top large and the bottoms you know a different size like you could do on like a different type of website so I hope that these just aren't falling off of me I don't know why I would think that like I'm like I'm some skinny tiny person but I hope this suit works out because I really like it okay so this one I'm a little bit disappointed because it is extremely small so of course the bottoms are teeny tiny um, and I couldn't really tell which one was the front and the back um, I kind of put them on both ways and it's yeah they're just not much there back there but they do fit pretty well it's the top again that just is not working for me it's just like you can see this is where the side of the cup is and there's that much extra so obviously these are definitely not the right size for me I not do any sort of like swimming or anything other than basically just laying on the the sand or laying on a lounge chair and just tanning in this because otherwise it could be a fashion uh, mishap. So this one is unfortunately not really going to work for me. Yeah, unfortunately, this is not going to be good for any of the larger chested ladies out there. But again, if you have smaller um, bra size, I highly recommend this suit. It is freaking adorable. And I'm just so bummed that it, it just doesn't work for me. <laughs> this next one is super fun. I also bought this one in a large um, and it's these hot hot pink little bottoms barely there as we've established and then the top i thought was so much fun and i thought i could wear this kind of like as a bralette with certain outfits because we all know thanks to my spring summer 2021 trends video you should watch it if you haven't already it's linked down below but bralettes are a big trend this year and i feel like a way that you could do that without going out and buying a specific bralette to wear is to wear bikini tops and i thought this one would be a cute one to do because it's got these fun little like frilly shoulder things going on which the straps are adjustable on that which is fantastic um, and this one also has like a little bit of padding in there which uh can you take it out yeah you can totally remove it if you like but i thought this was so fun like very barbie okay i seriously feel like barbie in this bikini i think it is so so freaking cute honestly like the ruffles are so much fun like this is such a cute little um, effect and like I said the straps are adjustable so that you can um, adjust them a little bit and um, feel like they're a little bit more secure but as they are right now I think they're fine um, I do think that the top I mean it's it definitely works I can make it work but I don't think it def it makes like this area look as like flattering and nice as something that would have like an underwire it's not the end of the world and I think it looks completely fine I <laughs> these bottoms are so small like oh my god they're really small in the front they're not too bad in the back this is like an amount of coverage that I'm definitely okay with I'm not completely uncomfortable um, and I do really like that this like high like leg uh, shape is in style right now because I feel like it really just makes my legs look so much longer I think it just is a very very flattering cut so um yes I love these bottoms a lot and yes this is a large did I get a large in this this is a large and I was concerned that the bottoms would be like too loose you never want like bathing suit bottoms to be like kind of loose because especially when you're swimming that is a no-go but actually I think these fit pretty pretty well I do have like a more curvy bottom half so there is that but 
all in all, this swimsuit is definitely a winner for me. This next suit, I already know it's just not gonna work for me, which is super unfortunate, but I, this is a size large, you guys. Please tell me in what universe this amount of fabric is a size large top. I would like to know because this is not a large. I have tried this on, I will try it on for you all, but it is like um, you're literally like one small breath away from a nip slip i don't know i really loved the way that this looked on the model and i was hoping for the large to have enough fabric but it doesn't and then we have the bottoms here which again you know like all the bottoms in this try on are teeny and okay so this one is definitely not gonna work this is in a large like side boob going on not a good side boob so clearly like this is just not a big enough top to hold these in on to another one piece and this one is really really fun metallic leopard one piece that's got this like cut out right here <laughs> Hi! <laughs> Types of one pieces have been like really trendy the last couple years. They're essentially a bikini, but they're not. They're a one piece. Um, and it's got these ties that wrap around your waist and you just thought this was super fun. It's very, very metallic. And I went and gambled with my life and got a medium. So we will see if this one actually fits everything in there. But I think this would be so fun, like on a, like maybe like a Vegas trip or um, some sort of fancy, bougie, all-inclusive in Mexico. This is like a hypothetical me dreaming of any kind of vacation happening this summer. So this swimsuit is a huge yes for me. She is giving me such like sparkly, ritzy, glam, over-the-top vibes. And we actually fit into this one, which is amazing. Like, I think this is so sexy and just, it's very, very unique. Obviously, put some sunscreen on your stomach unless you want some crazy, crazy tan lines. But um, I think that this one really is actually made pretty well. It's a medium, so I'm actually wearing a size that is technically my size. And I feel like everything fits in here properly. I don't feel like it's like coming out in ways that it should not be coming out. And yeah, I just, I have nothing bad to say about this one. Obviously, I'm not going to be doing anything crazy active in this. This is for lounging by the pool and looking hot. Secure enough that I feel like I can walk around. I could go to a party, a beach like party or a pool party in this and not constantly feel self-conscious that something is going to happen. I will say though that I figured out is the hack that I have for this is this tie that wraps all around your body, like pulling it tight is the key to keeping this part secure. So when I first tried it, I just literally crisscrossed it and then just pulled it really tight all around my body. But that was so uncomfortable for this area. I just, I hated it. So what I did was I first knotted it tightly here. And then that allows me to take this longer string and just sort of more loosely crisscross it all the way around my body. And that way this doesn't have to be tight and like really uncomfortable, but this can stay secure. So that is like my little hack. If you just said, all, this one is a big win for me. I okay, so this next suit gave me total safari vibes. And this one I also bought in a me. Oh, I got this one in a medium. Oof. Okay. Okay. You, you, all right. So <laughs> here are the bottoms. They're really high waisted. And of course they're like high cut on the thigh, but I love that it's got this little belt on it. How adorable is that? Um, these are sort of ribbed as well. And then the top is like a bra top, which maybe I should have gotten a large, but I don't even know if a large would have really done me much better in terms of cup size but it's got these nice little wide straps that unfortunately you cannot adjust um and then it does have some removable pads in the bra i just thought this was so cool and so neutral i thought it would be like a really cool suit to have when i like tan and again i thought this could be a good little bralette thing to incorporate into like more everyday looks but it's not a big enough bralette for these girls so yeah this one is so freaking cute. I'm obsessed. I love the bottoms. I love that they're like really high waisted. They're a bit more coverage. Obviously the bottoms are a little bit more, you know, they're cut to be very cheeky, but I love like just the belt. The whole bottom situation is so, so cute. I'm definitely living for that, but I just am so sad and disappointed that the top just again does not work for me, even though this is a large this is not a large Shein. Straps are definitely on the looser side. I kind of wish they were a little bit tighter so it would hold everything in place better. 
I really, really wanted this one to work because I feel like it is so chic, um, but it just isn't. Maybe hopefully I can find like some tops that I have already that I can wear these bottoms with because I think the bottoms are just really, really adorable. So this is turning out to be a Shein swimwear haul full of bottoms and unusable tops. Just tray unfortunate. Okay, I think I just have one more suit and this one is super fun, very different. So it's this floral bikini. So it's a high-waisted bikini bottom. It's definitely a little bit more coverage than some of the other ones are, but you can see it's going to be cheeky in the booty. Um, and then it's got this little pink sash that ties around. And then the top is so much fun. It is like this V neck cut. It's got this little strap that goes across. And then this one side has this big ruffle thing that goes over the strap. So I thought that was just something really fun and different. And I thought this was such just like a pretty, very feminine style bathing suit. And I feel like there is hope for this one, mostly because like it has some fabric here that I feel like I can work with. And because it's not like having an underwire in an actual cup, um, I could probably make this one work. Uh, and this is in a medium. So fingers crossed that this one works out. Okay, so this one is so freaking cute. It is a medium, so this is one of the few suits that actually I feel like is appropriately sized, and I love everything about this. The bottoms are just so fun. I love this little tie detail. They fit perfectly. They are a tiny bit cheeky, but I do feel like these are the most full coverage of all of the suits that I tried. The top actually works really well. I feel the most secure in this one. I feel like I could move around. I could swim around in this a bit um, and feel like nothing is going to go awry. Um, I will say in the product photos, the ruffle that the model is wearing looked a little bit more like pronounced and more dramatic. This one just seems like it kind of like chills. It doesn't really like stand up as much as hers did, but that's just a small little observation. It's not like a deal breaker. I have a version of this that's a one piece swimsuit that I thought about getting, but I felt like probably wouldn't work for me, but it's like a really deep plunging one piece and both sides of the plunge have this like ruffle on them. And I thought that one was so, so stunning as well. Yes, this one is a big win for me. I'm so glad I actually found at least one two piece swimsuit at Shein that I can actually uh, wear and not feel completely uh, afraid in, if you know what I mean. Well, that concludes my Shein bikini haul. Um, I have some thoughts before I wrap this up, and that is if you are shopping for bikinis on Shein, A, you should probably have a C cup at the largest. If you're bigger than a C, it's going to be very, very difficult. Um, and if you are bigger than a C, this is my recommendation is to don't go for the bathing suits that have an actual cup. Go for ones that are just like the last one that I tried on that's just kind of like a top that has maybe more fabric. You kind of have to eyeball things and look at the style and sort of get a feel for how it's going to be in real life. But Shein goes really skimpy on their sizes with their swimwear. I don't know why. I, and I really wish that they had swimwear for people like me who are in between like having a teeny tiny like nothing here and people who are plus size because I feel like that is a gap in the swimwear industry in general and drives me absolutely crazy because I want to be able to wear all these fun trendy swimsuits and they just like are never made for people like me so please leave me a comment and let me know if you've ever bought swimwear from Shein before how did it go for you let me know if there's another place that you want me to do a swimwear haul from if you're curious about how their sizing is or how it fits if you have like similar shape to me I know it can be so 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 hard so I feel you I see you I see you Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe if you didn't already. Check out these videos before you go. I think you're gonna really enjoy them and I will see you all on my next video. Bye.